Today I'm going to be discussing what could be happening in the ERLC Summer Update Part 2. Now, I believe I know what what four things I believe are coming. Now, we'll talk all about them today. Trains, semis, uh, Teslas, and new phones. Now, new phones, let's talk about them. So, new phones, I could see, like, you could add a FaceTime app where you could, like, see the other players, like, avatar or whatever, like, their photo. And then, like, you could have, like, a little FaceTime UI at the bottom where you can hang up. And, like, you have, like, a little chat box in the bottom where you can actually chat to them. It would basically be kind of similar to, like, texting, but this would be a face kind of thing. Um, you could add, like, a, a Twitter thing. But with, with semi trucks quick I wanted to show you that it would make sense because we're getting a map or we're not getting a map expansion but we had a map expansion and why would they add those if they're not gonna have semi trucks so I believe that semi trucks will be coming very shortly um I definitely think that is one of our biggest priorities for the game as it has been mentioned a lot and is highly wanted so I believe that somebody's would be coming um, based on that with the map expansion kind of thing. So we have um, they can like deliver like and like like they can deliver things around and like help people move and stuff and I'll be a skill. But with with um, phones you can have like a, a Twitter app. Now the Twitter app would be really really cool. Now like so this would be like there'd be a page for all the PRC developers to post their like uh, update leaks and things on that you can look at, kind of like a PRC Twitter. And then they'd also have another page um, where you could see like um, only server things. So like what I mean by this is like only people in the server can post like news updates and things on things that are happening in their life and just the server in general because if they did a worldwide one that thing would be getting spammed every second of things and it would just it would just be too much chaos and things to load and stuff so I think we should only do server wide and not worldwide um, like Twitter things so there will be a different Twitter thing for each server and then for semis like I was saying um, semis could get stuck on the train tracks and here's where the fun part with the trains come in. The trains can actually hit the semis and like police and things need to get to the scene and get like the person out and move the truck off the track before the like train hits it and if the train hits it it's even more work where you have to like check if everyone's okay, clean up the debris and all that stuff. And um Speaking of trains, I definitely think that trains will be a priority coming in the future, um, possibly in this update, based on that leak that we got of like the train sounds breaking. And um, yeah, I definitely think that trains are a big priority. Now, um, with, with trains, I believe that you would be able to ride in them. So there would be AI, like AI driven, um, basically kind of like the AI helicopters, but you would be able to ride in them and be taken to different station to station and things and stuff. So I think there will be like a farms station, there will be like a Springfield, a city, and like a housing suburb. So those would be like four stations. That would be kind of cool. And um, yeah, for slugs um in like parking lots don't worry what i'm doing here by the way it's i'm waiting on my guy over there who fell out of my car but real quick for teslas i think it would be cool like now that we have power lines the second the second i saw those power lines i'm like in the leak and they said electric day for girls seem like teslas have to be coming tomorrow teslas are coming today teslas blah 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 and then they never came so if they're continuing with this electric theme I can see Tesla's coming. Now, um, now with the electricity, you would be able to put 
electric charging stations at gas stations and different parking lots or whatever to charge the Teslas. And the yes, the cars would be fully electric, meaning that their sound in their motor would kind of be more that electric sound instead of like a like a motor sound because you're in a Tesla. So it would be really cool. Um, those are all my suggestions that I have for the update. I hope you all enjoyed and thank you all so much for watching. Slap the bell so you never miss a video and like and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. See y'all.